This is a Meanwell 110-240 volt industrial power supply that has been repaired and is now ready for a full load test. We are going to be testing at 115 volts. The output is 5 amps. We are going to start with measuring the voltage and make sure it's good coming out. As you can see on the meter, we are getting a good solid 24 volts. However, we want to make sure it's good under a full load. Output leads and ground are hooked up. We'll use the reading on the oscilloscope to make sure we have a clean 24 volts. To put under load, we'll power off the supply and wait until the bus caps drop all voltage. Now that it's under one volt, we will go ahead and hook up our dyna load. We have the current set to six amps and we'll attach our leads. We will turn our power supply back on and turn on our load. We can see on the meter the 24 volts. Now we'll apply the load at five amps. With the full load applied, we are no longer getting our output. Since we already changed the caps, we suspect a problem in the PWM circuit, which we can only detect because we tested under a full load. Just checking the voltage showed the supply to be good. This is why at Global Electronic Services, we believe in testing repaired units under a full load to ensure the repair is done right.